Hey guys, it's the Flea. We are back in Roblox Speed Draw, and today we are going to be trying to draw super realistic. We only have like, what, three minutes? Three minutes to draw realism? I think we're ready. This is going to be the challenge of the century, okay? So get your drawing gloves on. Let's go. We are going to draw a chicken. We are going to just go at the speed of light. All right, this is probably like what the head is going to look like. I think I'm going to add the dark red first, like the shadows of the red part of the chicken i don't know <laughs> this is gonna be really hard okay i think that's looking pretty good so far um i'm gonna add some of that rich really bright red into whatever the hell what 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 is this like flap of red skin called <laughs> okay we got we gotta get a move on we gotta get a move on okay now we have the gray and then we're gonna have the white and then we're gonna have the eye and then we're gonna put this pink leg oh my god we only have 20 seconds this is not looking realistic giant feather feather we got this guys we got I think we got it in. <laughs> a chicken nugget. That is so true. That is such a good chicken. It's a very realistic idea of chicken. <laughs> and we got another chicken nugget. Let's go. Look how cute the eye is. <laughs> Whoa. Oh my God, this guy's beak. This thing's looking kind of sus. Oh yeah, there's my chicken nugget. I think we got the realism down in the body of the chicken. What? Whoa, this realism thing is really working out for me. Okay. Do you guys like my fit, by the way? Check out my nails. They look sick. Ooh, banana. We are going to draw a banana. Let's fill the canvas. See, the realism part in drawing something is honestly just in the shading and the shapes. It's best to have a reference for things like this because it's really hard to do it otherwise. You'd have to have like an actual banana in front of you. Banana is looking so real. <laughs> We're flexing on these kids. We only have 20 seconds left. Oh my God. I put too much time into the other parts. Oh God. What? Oh God. Ah! Okay. Okay. My banana doesn't look too bad. That is truly like really what a banana looks like. Oh, this one's good too because you know, bananas have that green part also. Yeah. Yeah. We got the green in it. Looks like a shrimp. <laughs> banana split. Wait, banana split with the skin on it. Ew, girl. Banana spit. Bruh. Incredible banana spit, Nicole. Incredible. I applaud you. Also, I got second. We are winning this round. I think this effort is really paying off, even though this is taking 100% of my brain to draw this realistic <laughs> this early in the morning. Car. Uh oh, this one's gonna be hard. Just get the general shape in and then we're gonna color it in. You know the drill, you know the drill. And then we're gonna use a warmer tone and then we're gonna re-figure out where everything is. <laughs> this isn't very realistic, I'm so sorry. The realism has left the chat. Okay, this is a bumper or whatever it's called. I don't know, I don't drive. Freaking 20 seconds left again. Oh God. Oh God. No! No! <laughs> My realism! goofy car this is the goofiest car i've ever seen in my life <laughs> this is so cute it's kind of like a punch buggy oh look they're in the car and look at the wheels i think they're getting in a car wreck that's so sad <laughs> most terrifying car ever Woo! all right that was a win let's go all right even though my car is super angular i think the way that i colored it is in a realistic fashion i'm see i'm trying i'm fighting for my life to justify that that's realism okay <laughs> <laughs> Fighting for my life. Farm. Okay. Uh, okay. We're going to draw farm. This is going to have a lot of color because obviously farms, they're very colorful. Okay. Okay. The sky. Then we're going to get this very light color for the ground. Oh, what just happened? And then we're going to draw the rose. Okay. And then with a darker green, quickly put the trees in the background. Okay. Just a big blob. That's all it is. Okay. Don't even like think too hard about it. And then we're going to quickly draw the barns. We're going to draw three houses and then side of one house. Boom. Dark red. And another one. Boom. Boom. And then we're going to draw the roof. White. Boom. Silo. Boom. Done. And then make it tall like this. Oh God. Eek. Oh, I think that was pretty good. 
Yes. <laughs> that is the farmiest farm we've ever seen. Let's go. Oh, this is a great farm. This is five stars. We got the barn with the barn door and a fully colored and like realistic looking chicken. Ooh, this one's pretty good with the barn door as well. Tree barn. Yeah. <laughs> oh, this is so good. Oh, what is the what's a cow doing? What's that cow doing? Oh, farm fresh bacon and farm fresh egg. Woo! We got second. Yeah. Woo! Let's freaking go. Okay, I'm literally unstoppable. Ha <laughs> ha. Okay, donut know what those are because i tried to learn how to use blender okay we got a reference we got the reference let's move boom boom the bread boom the shading boom again the other shading oh chocolate glaze boom perfect oh my god this is looking so delicious okay we are gonna go with a little bit of a gray the gray is what we're using to highlight this donut the power of color theory there perfect okay now we're gonna do the sprinkles uh, uh, this is just gonna be easy because we only have 20 seconds. Pink sprinkles. <gasps> Woo! This is so cute. Donut. That is not a donut. I guess it's technically donut. So two. <laughs> Five. I'm gonna give it five. That's actually a really good donut. Donut, if the sprinkles were about an inch big, there's my donut. I was literally gonna be like, whoa, who drew that? <laughs> It's me who drew the donut. This donut's very good. Very, very good. Not enough icing. Woo! Damn, we're taking the wins every freaking time. Holy. All right, we cannot be stopped, guys. This is the realism takeover. Soon, this whole server will all be realism. Now that they know that this is what it takes to win. <laughs> Princess. Okay, we're drawing Peach. Wait, can we draw Peach realism? Let's draw the Peach from the Mario movie because that's kind of realistic, right, guys? We're gonna draw quickly the hair. Get the shape of the hair. In. Boom, boom, uh, boom again. <laughs> this is a very stressful job, just saying. <laughs> Someone mentioned that her bangs are like the shape of a heart. I didn't notice that before, and I think that is such a great design choice. Okay, um, Peach's peach skin. Help! Don't worry about it. Don't worry about it. I will, I will make this look like peach. Don't worry. Don't worry. Ah, why is it gray? Forget this realism thing. I'm dropping the realism. No, 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 who is that? That's not Peach. This is so cute. This is very cool abstract art, but unfortunately, it's not giving princess. It's me. She's like, I'm the princess. <laughs> good princess, good princess. Whoa. Okay, I got second. That's pretty good. Popsicle. Okay, we are gonna draw the SpongeBob popsicle. You know, you know the one. All right. Oh, this is orange. Oh, this is still orange. There we go. That's kind of pink, but whatever. Okay. And then we're gonna draw the beady looking eye. And then we're gonna go in with this like dark blue to shade the beady eyes. Oh, we only have 20 seconds left. I'm only, holy, we don't have a lot of time. Help me! Oh, the stick, the stick. Okay. Ah, ah, woo, that's a good one. It's one of those ones that you like can break apart and share. Ooh, that's a really good popsicle. It's even got like 3D effect on the side. That's really sick. That one's really good too. It's melting. It's got the stick. Oh, this one's similar too. Although the lines kind of give me Mickey Mouse's gloves. <laughs> Whoa. This is kind of creepy. This is kind of haunting and terrifying. Whoa, we got second. All right, we got second. This is epic. Okay, this is another landscape one. This is gonna be difficult. Use all our brain power. Let's go. Sky, boom. Clouds, boom, done. The gradient in the sky, boom, done, again. Let's get the grass in. Okay, we're gonna see some bees. We're gonna see some plant life. Just get up close and personal with the bugs. You know what I mean? Bugs like me. <laughs> we're just gonna draw a big old tree in the back. Background. Tree, boom, done. Flowers, deploy the flowers. Ooh, ooh. Buttercups, the buttercups have landed. This is like I'm Gordon Ramsay running like a Michelin star restaurant. I am stressed. We need some color around here. We need a bee. This bee's our only hope. We made it. Let's go. A spring. <laughs> This is real. This is real. Okay, we got a flower. Oh, this is so cute. That looks so cute. I really like the green flower. I think it's good. I'm giving it four. Look at the way that they drew the sun. That's really interesting. Yes, there's my magnum opus. Woo! Let's go! 
Oh my god, it looks so good from way over here too. Oh, nerd. Uh, let's draw a realistic nerd, I guess. Let's draw realism nerd emoji, okay? Oh, right. This is gonna be good. This guy kind of looks pretty cool. He doesn't really look like a nerd until <laughs> now he's a nerd. <laughs> Drop shadow quick. Oh, the shadow wasn't that good, but hope that worked. <laughs> I forgot the freckles. That's okay. That's okay. Okay, she's really cute. She kind of looks like a Splatoon character. Oh, this is so cute. Wait, wait, we're drawing the same thing. Uh-oh. Noob. Oh. Woo. We got third. Let's go. We are not here to compare, okay? Oh, they're jumping around my nerd. Woo. Woo. Let's jump around the nerd. Let's jump around the nerd. <laughs> Last one, rainbow. We are going to do a landscape for this rainbow. I know. Rainbows come out after like a rainstorm and stuff like that like rainy looking clouds and then we're gonna have a mountain right here and another mountain in the foreground right and then we have the snowy peaks at the top and then we're gonna have green and then slowly turning darker you know the drill uh oh red we need red oh my god i almost forgot the red uh, okay the background is way too messy you can't even tell what's going on it's a good rainbow it's a pretty good one. Ooh, this one's cool it's coming out the side <gasps> a pot of gold yes it kind of looks a little bit sus the colors are kind of like not in order but that makes it look kind of cool yeah <laughs> All right, guys, thank you guys for watching another video. This was really fun. Drawing in realism is pretty difficult, honestly, but it makes it so much easier when you could look up a reference. Looking up references for doing anything always helps really train your eye to see what kind of colors go where and how the color changes when it's in the shadow and when it's in the light. If you try this challenge, it might be a bit difficult, especially with the three minute time limit, but this kind of practice, it's like working out your brain to draw. It's like stretching before before you go for a run. Really good practice to help you just like warm up for drawing. So hope you guys try it out. Anyways, it's been fun. This has been The Flea. Thank you guys for watching. Bye. <laughs>